Hello guys, Susie Cody here and uh, welcome back to Wildflowers. Oh my god, I, ha I have been looking forward to the next episode already because like this game is so cute, so adorable and I can't get enough of it. We have a lot of on the schedule so let's hit that resume. We're getting back now. Alrighty, let's see. Yeah, we need mushrooms for the stew or something. And the most elaborate icebreaker. It's gonna be very interesting. <laughs> All right. Uh, <laughs> I didn't um, like. I was surprised about this particular that she actually jumping over the fences, which is genius, by the way, because it takes a lot of time to run over here. So it's when I saw this on Switch, I was like, yay! You can always go for shortcuts when she can jump over. <laughs> it's just like that. So that was amazing. Okay, let's see where we can. Hey, I remembered this mine. It looked way less run down when I was seven, but so did everything around here. <laughs> All right, now yeah, that mine has seen better days. That's for sure. Oh, we definitely need that. I think. And here we have mushrooms. We will take trees. Is there? There's a lot of them here. Okay, we gotta go with the mushrooms to our grandma first and then go down to the little village, which is super cozy. Oh my gosh. So let's see, where is our grandma inside the house maybe? Yup, here she is all sitting by the table. How adorable is she? Like, for real. <laughs> Hello, Grandma Hazel. I have the mushrooms. Ah, spring is the time when the earth reawakens. You can forage for the gifts the land offers up if you know where to look. Have you found any mushrooms? I found some mushrooms. Will these work? Those are nice plump ones. You're a natural forager. When I was out searching, I came across that old mine. You used to tell me that there were goblins inside, remember? <laughs> I told you that, did I? <laughs> it was a, a smart way of keeping a curious little girl out of danger. The wood in the support rotted clean through. Shame. I'm sure there's still perfectly good iron and copper down there. Come back tomorrow and I'll have the mushroom stew prepared. I'm a bit tired just now. Understandable. Alrighty. Yeah, that is actually a change I'm gonna do with this playthrough, really, because I was really slow at getting things when I was playing this on Switch, so it took a lot of time to get in money. But like getting the mine fixed, something you definitely should prioritize, and also get better pickaxes. Oh my gosh, that one you get in the first place is well, you use a lot of energy with it. <laughs> um, what would I supposed to do now? I had a special, a special thought, a specific thought in my mind, but I forgot it. <laughs> wow, I have a goldfish brain today, you guys. I'm sorry about that. But let's head down. Yeah, let's head down to the village. Oh yeah. Oh, this is so adorable. And you have this board here where you can like notice board. We can do things for the village and you will get money, so prioritize that as well to get money going. So we need that for our f future farm animals and more crops, fields and such. Spoiler alert! I'm sorry guys. <laughs> ah, hello! Oh, hello! Welcome! Welcome, welcome! I am Mayor Otto Soft and you must be the new voter. I mean neighbor. Uh, hi, uh, yes, that's, that's me. If there is anything you need, I'm the one to speak to. We're a friendly town here at Fairhaven. We want to make sure you're settled in well. To that end, we want you to meet everyone, so we've made it a little game. The fine Fairhaven folk will let me know after they've met you. That way, I can give you a prize after you've met everyone. <laughs> It's so. really quite clever and progressive. <laughs> Plus, a little bit creepy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're funny. Anyway, come oh, and see me gosh. after you've met everyone. 
So yeah, she she he is actually forcing us to meet everyone, which is yeah, like she said, creepy, but also a good thing. So we have only met five of the twenty-two people around here. Welcome. I am Vanessa Soft, First Lady of Fairhaven. Pleasure to meet you. How is your grandmother doing? She's... well... To be honest, she's not doing too well. That's why I'm here. It's wonderful that you came to help her out. Do let me know if there is any way I can help. Thank you. Oh, like 22 people, you guys. It's a lot of people to meet, but we need to do our best, actually. I'm Tara. I just moved to town. Ah, you must be Hazel's granddaughter. It sure is great to meet you. I'm Parker, Lena's husband. She asked me to stop by your farm in a day or two and show you around. You'll want to know where Lena's general store is. It's hard to run a farm without it. I'll be by before you know it to point it out to you. Okay, guys, I think it will take time for me to meet all 22 people. And I kind of want to get to day two as well. So I will do very fast uh, greeting things and we will definitely meet all these people eventually during our playthrough. So I don't think it's that important to see every 22 greetings. <laughs> so I will do it pretty fast and we will be back when I'm done it and maybe already on day two. So give me a second, I will be right back. I have a feeling we should have the recording on while going into the forest. Yes. <laughs> Fairhaven Woods. I'm still in the way of the text though. Try to move myself up. Oh, how cozy it is here. Like, how adorable can Fairhaven be though? Very adorable. And getting even more adorable. Ooh. And wow, there's a lot of things to gather here. Oh, a kitty! I need to go over to the kitty, but I need all these mushrooms because I knew there was a notice on the notice board about those Todd stools. Hi there! Come here! Oh, the sound! I'm not sure if you're hearing it, but it was so cute. It's actually purring. Oh, too adorable. All right, we will keep going. I think we need to actually go to bed. So we will actually start day two pretty soon. I was lucky to click on that record button. <laughs> Who's that? I have still not figured out who this is uh, on Switch either, so... I wonder who that is, really. It's called a raven, but it still hasn't, like shown itself to me so i have no clue i'm still waiting for that on my switch as well and day two here we are how early are we standing up 7 a.m okay <laughs> hello grandma hazel Lena brought us some extra milk while you were out, so I made us a delicious mushroom soup sure to warm our bellies. And your, your shirt had the right number of, uh, gills or whatever? We're not going to start seeing things or frothing at the mouth? <laughs> no, if I gave you something that made you see things, it'd be on purpose. Uh, Grandma! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. She's so adorable, you guys. I have another chore for you that would be a great help if you don't mind of course grandma what is it some wood for the fire would be nice nights are still cold in the spring around here could you go and find a couple of the big old logs lying around the farm chop them up for me and bring me the wood sure thing grandma oh, you'll need this to get started oh rusty wood axe so that is also a thing that also takes a lot of energy, so you need food, obviously. But it's also the same thing with a big axe. Get a better, better axe as well, to use less energy. And chop up the bigger trees. So, wouldn't you know it? I love the names of this quest, really. Thank you, Grandma. What's happening? Ooh! 
I see. We have some clouds around the different areas we haven't been at yet. So when we have discovered them, they will disappear. Alrighty. Don't forget to water those potatoes every day. I will... Oh, Parker is here. Hello. It's me, Parker again. I stopped by just like I promised. How are you settling in? I'm getting there. I hear you. I moved here from the city myself 10 years ago. Oh, how long did it take you to feel comfortable here? I'll let you know. Lena's busy right now, so I wanted to show you the way to the general store. It's really important for anyone running a farm because she can buy all your produce and sell you new seeds. It'll be hard to make ends meet if you can't sell your goods. I'm heading there now if you want to tag along. Sure. Yes, that would be fantastic. I get turned around in town sometimes. Great. Follow me. Follow ya. We gotta do that. All right, here is the general store, I suppose. Yup, we got the cute. There you are, Oopsie. and you brought Tara. Wonderful, Tara. I can't wait to buy your fresh crops. And if you need seeds, I can sell you whatever's in season. Oh, Parker, we need to talk about the kids. They were giggling over breakfast, so I searched Finn's backpack and found a whoopee cushion in there. Again. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, that's that's terrible. Uh, see? That's the problem right there. You think it's funny, and I have to be mommy cop. No, I'm taking this seriously, really. Okay, whatever. You can be the one to go to the next parent-teacher conference. I'm tired of getting stared down by Vanessa. Aw. Sorry to hear that. Mini Hazel. Still here, I see. You can call me Tara, if you want. Because that's my name. Ah, oh, I kind of like Minnie Hazel, but suit yourself. Oh, hey, Bruno. Damon, I want to settle up for last night. Sorry I didn't have it on me at the time. <laughs> that's all right. I knew you were good for it, but uh, <laughs> thanks. Fish just haven't been biting lately, but I got Otto to float me for a week. I wish you hadn't told me that. Your son already has it out for me, Bruno. That's not so. He's just a teetotaler, is all. And who's your new friend here? Guten Tag. You're Hazel's granddaughter, aren't you? Yes. Are you German? And also psychic? <laughs> I'm Bruno. Don't actually speak much of my native tongue, but I try to keep up some traditions. And you're just a picture of your grandma when she was a girl. I am? Yeah. She was a real spitfire back then, too. Hasn't changed much. I see you met Damon. Tara, watch out for this boy. He's trouble. Hey, I'm trying to make a good first impression here. Do you mind? <laughs> oh, Bruno, you are such an adorable guy, I must say. Oh, this is Sophia. Welcome to Cafe Moretti. What can I get you today? Oh, I'm new here. I just came by to say hello. It does smell great in here, though. Wait, you're... Hazel's granddaughter. Welcome. Uh, I hope you come back soon. Moving always works up an appetite. Oh, where are my manners? I'm Sophia. Hey, Sophia. I'm Tara. It's nice to meet you. Like, Sophia here is an adorable villager. Everyone is so adorable. And here we have Amira. And who is this beautiful creature I see? I mean, she's I, very flirty. Uh, what? Uh... I'm Tara, Hazel's granddaughter. <laughs> Hazel told me her granddaughter was coming to town, but didn't mention that she was so lovely. Oh, thanks. <laughs> I'm Amira, the doctor here in Fairhaven. I've been taking care of your grandmother. Oh, wow, thank you. I came as soon as I heard she was sick. <sighs> She's lucky to have such a caring family. Well, I mean, to be honest, we kind of fell out of touch for a while. I'm trying to make up for lost time. We can't regain lost time. But you're here for her now. That is enough. Okay, wow, you guys, time flies. Anyway, we are out of time, unfortunately. So, of course, we're gonna keep going with greeting people. <laughs> the next day, we're still during day two and eventually go over to day three. But that raven witch, oh, I'm still wondering who that is. I have not figured it out on my other game save and I'm still so curious about that one. Seems to be some kind of evil witch. I don't know yet. Or wizard. 
we don't know if it's a girl or a boy behind that mask. So I so want to figure it out. Like, where, when, who is this person? But still not away. So you guys, tell me, have you tried out Wildflowers yet? And what do you think about it? Are you playing it on computers or Switch? Let me know in the comments below. And what do you think is the most adorable thing about this game? I have so many things to choose from, so I'm not sure. Like, Hazel, Tara's grandmother, is too adorable. I just love her so much. And Lena is such a lovely lady that runs the store. And Sophia, of course, with a diner. Like, oh, this town here, this village here, this island. Adorable, 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 and adorable. Yeah, it's just so adorable. <laughs> I can't wait to continue with it. And if you have got the game yet, get it. It's so adorable. So yeah. We will continue, like I said, I hope you had an amazing time watching this today's video. And if you want me to do any guides or tips and tricks, let me know. I do know a lot of things already, but I will try not to spoil too much either. I heard I have done it already a lot during this episode, so let me know. I cannot do that. So yeah. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, share it with your friends and family, and also subscribe to my channel for more Wildflowers episodes. I will have them out every Saturday from now on. So I can't wait, and I hope you will join me and have a look at them. See you already tomorrow for a new Hogwarts Legacy episode.